Hi everyone, welcome to our Halloween edition of PA Harness Week. Wait till you see Heather and Steve, or Steve and Heather. We'll profile one top trotter who is more than just lucky. We'll also head to Mohegan Sun of Pocono Downs to see a grain of truth win again on the Red Clay Oval. And we'll also head down to Bluegrass Country and Red Mile. That's all next on Racing's fastest pace half hour, PA Harness Week. Here they go. Explosive pattern wins the Colonial easily. Underway. Welcome racing fans to the fastest half hour on television and we like to call it PA Harness Week. I'm C. Ross and the lovely lady to my right, the beautiful and vivacious and sexy babe. Heather Moffitt, we like to call her HMO, loving them fishnet stockings. Thank you, thank you so much. You know what, you look great today. I feel especially handsome this morning. Happy I... Halloween, by the way. Happy Halloween. That's or as right. we say for small Halloweens, happy Halloweeny. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna head right up to Mohegan Sun at Pocono Downs, cause my mustache is feeling a little weird right now. So I'm gonna let you handle the first race, babe. I can do it, babe, don't worry about it. Okay, pictures of Millie uh, with George Knapp was seven to five. Okay, by the way, isn't that your mom's name? Yeah, my mom's name is Mildred. She hates to be called Millie, though. Don't call her Millie. But I bet she liked pictures of Millie, wouldn't she? Like, or pictures of Ben Franklin from betting on pictures of Millie. Anyway, seven to five with Georgie Knapp. Too salty, and that's how I like my nuts, by the way, was nine to five with Jim Worrell Jr. And all about justice, Mike Simon was the three to one third choice. And now here's that sexy track announcer, Jim Bevilia, who I call Big Jim. It's now pictures of Millie in control. She's got it by about a length. Big Pepper looking to fight back, and all about justice makes the first over ploy. He's within two of the leader, and uh, uh, coming in a little bit closer now, picking up that live cover is too salty fourth showing trot our last photo getting backed up behind big pepper while ginger tree jimmy now getting into it fifth moving up quick on the outside but pictures of millie still in charge three quarters 125 and two 28 and two third panel it's pictures of millie by about a length and a half too salty has now taken over second on the outside all about just to switch to the inside ginger tree jimmy is fourth following cover top of the stretch it's pictures of millie all about justice now taking to the passing lane and is gaining pictures of Millie having to dig in here but pictures of Millie this Philly is a lot of talent well go figure pictures of Millie won it on the engine beating all about justice by about this much <laughs> or maybe it was this much I don't really know but it was by some okay well my tear almost fell off my head anyway that was what happened there too salty who left a bad taste in some better's mouths was third all right, thanks, babe. Oh, hold on, my gold chain's choking me a little bit. Um, it's on the same night, it's the open trot, $24,000, grain of truth, it's a favorite. Took a career best last time out. Then we got PJ Clark. He goes into this race with the most wins in this field. And then Florida Mac attack, he's got Joe Pavia Jr. in the bike. Grain of Truth has won three of his last four in this group, and the Red Hot Trotter has the lead here with Tom Jackson as the four to five favorite. The Yonker Shipper Water a Hustler getting the pocket trip early. Two more back to Bad Boy Paparazzi third, followed there by Baby Boy Grin. It's Florida Mac attack fifth. One in Blazes is also off stride. PJ Clark off stride. So the top five really the only ones still with a shot here. They hit the half at 56 even, 29 even second panel. This time around, it's Grain of Truth on the front end. He's doing the work on his own here with what a hustler getting the pocket trip. Baby Boy Grin showing trot on the outside first over. He's picking off horses moving up on second real quick. Inside Bad Boy Paparazzi has dropped back just a bit and Florida Mac attack making his late run. Grain of Truth holding on to that lead by three parts of a length as Baby Boy Grin continues to brush. Three quarters, 124 and 2. 28 and 2 third panel. Baby Boy Grin now right along 
alongside Grain of Truth. Meanwhile, Florida Mac Attack ranging up third. What a hustler still there on the inside. At the top of the stretch, it's Baby Boy Grin trying to take it to Grain of Truth. Florida Mac Attack shifting to the inside for Pavia. Grain of Truth is digging in. Florida Mac Attack inside. Baby Boy Grin outside. How game is Grain of Truth? Grain of Truth won its 10th win of 2010. A wire to wire victory. Wasn't he 14 to 1 last week? And he was very short this week. I can't figure that out. Uh, I can't either, babe. All right, time of the mile, 153 and 3. This horse is approaching $200,000 for earnings this season. Be uh, baby Boy Grin was second and third went to Florida Mac Attack. Do not go away, whatever you do. I'm going to fix my mustache. And while we're at a commercial break, <laughs> we're going to come back. We got lots of chester action. Stick around. Get ready, because table games have come to Harris Chester with more hometown action than ever before. It's the only Philadelphia area casino that earns you comps at Total Rewards casinos like Harris Resort in Atlantic City. Play big with a huge new selection of poker, blackjack, craps, roulette, and so much more. New games, new action, and the most rewarding card program. Harris Chester, be part of the fun. Play at Harris Chester with your Total Rewards card and earn great comps and offers for Harris Resort in Atlantic City. Quotable, got Why do so many winners ball. travel in EB trailers? They love the ride. EB Pay Center trailers deliver your horses in peak condition, ready to race every time. Designed to provide safe and comfortable transport for standard bred racehorses, EB's Pay Center Series trailers are the preferred choice of professional standard bred trainers and breeders nationwide. All EB Pay Center models feature custom standard bred options and excellent airflow and aligned interior ceiling to keep your horses fresh and comfortable. Every EB trailer has commercial quality componentry and riveted sidewall construction engineered and designed to stand up to constant and rigorous horse and road use. And a sleek aerodynamic nose design that also delivers improved fuel savings. More winners ride with EB than any other trailer. EB, setting the pace in standard red horse transportation. 